Hello viewers, welcome to Elimu TV, a station where you watch and learn. I am your tutor, Sarah Maitha. So today I'm taking you through CRE Form 2, Lesson 22. Our topic today is Jesus teaching in parables. And our subtopic today is the importance of parables. Welcome. We start by looking at our lesson objectives. What is expected, ex expected of the learner by the end of the lesson? So by the end of the lesson, the learner should be able to give examples of parables used by Jesus. Two, by the end of our lesson, the learner should be able to explain reasons why Jesus teaches using parables. What do we mean by a parable? Parables. A parable is a short story which teaches something or answers some questions. It's an allegory, another story with hidden or heavenly meaning. So it's Jesus in his teaching, most of the time he used parables in his teaching. Examples of the parables Jesus used. We have the parable of the sower. We have the parable of the lamp and a bowl. We have a parable of a fig tree, the parable of the good Samaritan, and so many. So in his teaching, Jesus used parables. And you have seen examples of the parables. What are the reasons that Jesus used parables when teaching? Why did Jesus use parables in teaching? So Jesus used parables in his teaching in order to explain a familiar message in a language that his hearers could not could understand. So let's look at other reasons why Jesus wanted or used parables in his teaching. One reason is to provoke his listeners to think. Jesus used parables to provoke his listeners to think. A parable you have to think to get the meaning. So Jesus was there to provoke his listener to get a meaning and to think to get a meaning. Jesus used parables to put truth in a clear and challenging way. He wanted to put truth in a clear and challenging way. To familiarize his listeners with everyday life circumstances. He wanted to familiarize his listeners with everyday life circumstances. Jesus used parables to explain the nature of the kingdom of God. To explain the nature of the kingdom of God. By giving real life examples also, Jesus used parable to explain the nature of God. Because the parables brought out the attributes of an invisible God. For example, the parable of the prodigal son who had been lost. He get the attributes of an invisible God. So parables used to, used to explain the nature of God. To attract the attention of his audiences. Jesus used parables to attract the attention of his audiences so that they could listen and understand. So that they could listen and understand. Jesus used parables to make people understand how they should relate to one another. Like the parable of the good Samaritan. He used the parables to make people understand how to relate with each other. For example, by using the parable of the good Samaritan, how people relate with each other. To teach God's love for mankind. For example, the parable of the lost sheep or the lost coin. To teach God's love for mankind. How Jesus identified those who are sincere in seeking the kingdom of God from the onlookers. Another reason why Jesus used parables in his teaching is to make an indirect attack to his opponents. To make an indirect attack on his opponents, like the Pharisees, the scribes, and the Sadducees. 
he would make an indirect attack to his opponent by using parables. Another reason why Jesus used parables is to make his teaching interesting and easy to understand. He wanted to make his teachings interesting and easy to understand. So those are some of the reasons why Jesus used parables in his teaching. And we have looked at examples of the parables Jesus used. There are so many. So we have, that's the end of our lesson. And I will leave you with the following question. Give reasons why Jesus used his parables in his teachings. For our references, you can refer to Secondary Christian Religious Education, Student Book 2, KLB 3rd Edition. Thank you for joining us for this and more. Any case you have a question, a suggestion, or a comment, you can contact us through our SMS number, which is on the screen. You can also find us on YouTube at Elimu TV. You can also find us on U Facebook, Elimu TV, and on Twitter at Elimu TV underscore KE. Till next time, bye bye.